this morning we pulled up the anchor and left Bonner Bay heading over to the uh, Alligator River. As you can see, we crossed over the Pamlico, headed up the Pungo River, past Bellhaven, and then dropped the hook at the mouth of the Alligator River. On the way, we were able to do a bunch of work because the sea state was really calm. Uh, here you can see Jeff is beginning to shine up some of the stainless in the cockpit. Uh, we did a ton of work because the conditions were so good. Um, we were able to shine up all the stainless from the cockpit up to the gates. Um, you could see here the water was like a mirror as we were traveling. Uh, it really allowed us to get a lot of work done. Um, I took some really great shots from the bow of the boat and you can just see that the sun was shining and the water was calm. It was a nice warm day but it wasn't too hot uh, and we really enjoyed just being out on the water and getting some work done aboard Bear. You can see Jeff here he had his computer out, he's probably working on one of his classes. Uh, and it was just a calm and beautiful day. So for me, it was one of the best days to be out. Um, I like to get work done. I also like it when the water is really flat calm. <laughs> it doesn't really uh, mean that we do a lot of sailing. Um, but when we got into the Alligator River, it was like we were in another world. Uh, I really enjoyed seeing all of the trees and the driftwood um, and it was just calm and peaceful and uh, again it was just a great day to be out there. Well as you can see behind me it's coming down pretty hard. Um, it's I think about 6.30. Um, we just put the hook down uh, 20 minutes, half an hour ago in the uh, very head of the Alligator River here off a deep point. Um, this is a place that I anchored at last year with my cousin Tim. We had a great night, a uh, beautiful sunset. I don't know if it's going to clear up enough for uh, the sun to come out, although I can see some clear skies over that way and the rain is slowing up just a little bit. Um, 600 miles we've done so far. Uh, pretty amazing. Uh, we got another 100 to go to Norfolk and 240 to go to Annapolis. Um, tomorrow we're going to either head up to Buck Island, uh, anchor off there on July 4th, or we will push on a couple more miles and, um, and head into uh, Coin Jock. Benefit of Coin Jock is that we will have an awesome dinner there. Um, you guys all know that Coin Jock is known for prime rib. Um, great cruiser stop there. Uh, Mark and I don't eat meat, but they also have some absolutely amazing fish there too. Uh, the place is really just ridiculously good food. Um, bad thing about Coin Jack though is that uh, we'd have to pay for dockage, um, and it's $1.75 a foot. Um, I don't know what's going to happen. We're sort of divided on it. We could, uh, we could do laundry while we're there too. Although we're going to get in late and uh, and leave early, so um, it's not like we're going to be using the facilities or anything like that. Uh, regardless, we will stop at the Coinjock Marina to get a pump out and uh, get some gas. Um, whether it's tomorrow night or whether it's the morning of the fifth, we will see. Um, yeah, so tomorrow up the Alligator River and uh, across the um, Albemarle Sound, and then up what I think is the Bear River. I'm not exactly sure. Um, but, uh, you know, tomorrow should be a pretty uneventful day, uh, although I do have good friends um, from the Jersey Shore who were coming down after the, what was that, Hurricane Isabel, I think, uh, back in maybe 2002 or three or something like that, and uh, they um, ran into a, a log. Um, that was washed out by the, the hurricane. This was a couple weeks after the hurricane though. Uh, washed out, out by the hurricane and they um, they tore off their prop shaft and they were stuck in some little little tiny town for like a month while they were waiting for parts and repairs and things like that. So we will certainly be on the alert for uh, things like that. This area, you know, what we traveled through today and then what we're going through tomorrow is, is, is well known for, uh, you know, logs and deadheads and everything else um, so we'll, we'll have our, our eyes open um, yeah uh, getting excited to get to the Chesapeake um, even more excited to 
pick up the mooring in, in Annapolis and uh, head on over to, to Pusser's. But uh, good day today. We got a lot of miles done and it wasn't too hard until this last stretch through the alligator pungo, which was just boring. But uh, yeah, take it easy, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and hit subscribe. Next time on Return to Seasons, our video will be about our travels from the Alligator River to South Lake.